my question to you is are we moving towards ram rajya is the prime minister moving india towards a ram rajya see if you are looking at ram rajya this is exactly what i said just now if you are thinking of a perfect state no but are we striving yes we are striving like never before definitely i believe prime minister has the intention to strive to create that nation that all of us want will it happen tomorrow morning that's a joke if you think so it never happens like that it's a striving if all of us are striving in that striving our lives are beautiful not because we got there it's beautiful life is beautiful because we are striving for something that we hold as very high what in our country right now uh, you know by the government by the prime minister or the things you see around you sadguru are indicators to you that this striving towards ram rajya is something that is happening the reason i ask this question is because we uh, live in a constantly churning vitiated atmosphere where there are polarized opinions mm, as no, far as no that Kaliyo is only in the news rooms it's concerned. not so in the country only in the news rooms it's vitiated <laughs> uh if you live in the country in the rest of the country apart from delhi everywhere everything is fine uh <laughs> so uh, don't believe that i mean we, you are supposed to make us believe that you should not believe that yeah. so <laughs> so the thing is vitiated vitiated where is it vitiated see one uh, one loose can shout something well it's repeated 125 times in a day on the news channel none of us heard that nonsense that whatever some mad uh, nonsense repeated over and over again on the news channel is not heard by anybody else in the country and nobody else is saying such things so country is not vitiated it's a very wrong notion please walk around the villages of this nation which is where we live and we work there is no any kind of vitiated divisions in the country no, i i was talking about I, i was talking about the political sphere i take your point about the media but i was talking about no i am not i am not trying to blame the media it's media's business to highlight that i am not saying you shouldn't be doing it i'm just saying don't believe it because you are taking out certain things which make news and that is not the nature of the nation so in the nation right now there is a huge striving for economic well being is there a striving absolutely absolutely everywhere there's a new hope in the villages everybody is thinking they will live better they are already living better you can say maybe not exactly but there is a hope because they are better connected they are striving for more and i think a whole lot of people because we have schools in rural areas we see children are eating better it's visible it's very visible whichever part of the world i go the first thing i look at is the rural children if you look at them you know what is the condition of the society our children's condition has been terrible in the last 50 years but today you will see in the last 3 to 4 years time young kids who come to school at 5 or 6 years of age they are little better fed uh which is an indicator which is clearly visible so are they striving yes they are striving will we get there i think we will unless we goof it up in some big way the way the trajectory is i think in the next 5 years there will be a significant change do you believe that everything will be perfect no that would be foolish to even think like that but will people be living better economically yes it is just that we have to manage the other aspects of life equally well one important thing that's a concern for me is right now on an average the soil organic content this is something maybe a strange language for all of you because you live in delhi because you don't use soil you all came from mars maybe i don't know <laughs> i don't know where you come from but the soil organic content in the nation on an average is 0.6% the minimum organic content that is necessary to call soil as soil is 3% but we are 0.6%. This is a disaster unfolding. You come from the south, next time you fly from Delhi to Bangalore or somewhere, every five minutes just look out and see, you see a brown desert which you call as India.